beautiful people. Hey Taurus, welcome to my channel in the Tarot 1122. Alright, so we're just going to do a general message for you. See what survived. Get the messages that we need. And uh, yeah, this will not resonate with everyone. So take what fits and leave the rest. Feel free to check the other signs in your chart once they're posted. If you like how I get on with my readings, please hit the like button for your girl. Okay? New subscribers, welcome to my channel. I appreciate you being here. I hope I can give more information that will resonate with you. Please realize that, uh, yeah, like I said, not every res uh, reading will resonate with you guys. I do apologize. I'm a little tired. Had some readings today. And, uh, yeah, still posting for the channel. So, yeah. And then I got to get ready for work tomorrow. All right. So, let's see. Apparently, I have cards that don't belong here. And, of course, my camera started when I wasn't ready. So, yeah. All right. So, let's see. I'm going to start off with the tarot and uh, then into the oracle if called for. Okay. All right. Let's see. What messages do we have for Taurus? All right. Four of Swords. All right. So you're resting, rejuvenating. Huh. Possibly thinking about a situation. All right. Possibly overthinking a situation. Looks like you're watching somebody or somebody's watching you. Please keep in mind that the roles can be reversed. It's just easier for me to say that it's you. I might flip back and forth. Just take it how it resonates, okay? You do have a brand new stable beginning here. Then possibly some money. All right. Let's see. All right. You have temperance. You're being very patient. But you're watching somebody though. Or someone is watching you. All right. You have an opportunity coming towards you that uh, looks like you are going to take this leap of faith towards this opportunity. Looks like you're contemplating. <laughs> you're looking at it first, though, kind of staring at it like, I don't know if I really want this, but I guess. Yeah, I guess I'll take it. Hmm. It's not much. They're coming in as a page, but I guess I'll take it. Something's calling for you to take a look at this from a new perspective, okay? Because what you don't see, it might be coming in as a page or this offer might be very small, but it's actually going to lead to abundance here, okay? All right, so you're manifesting new beginnings, all right? So be humble. It may be humble beginnings here, but it's going to lead you to abundance. Like I said, there's something you don't see here. Okay, so just woosah. It's okay. <laughs> it's all right to start at the, you know, I won't say at the bottom, bottom, but hell, even if you got to start at the bottom. Started from the bottom, now we're here. I'm just saying, it's the pinnacles. You got to start somewhere, sweetheart, okay? All right, let's see. Sometimes it may look like something small, but it turns out to be something very abundant, a blessing for you, okay? So, yeah, don't turn your nose up at certain things, okay? Look at it. Some blessings come in small packages, big, big blessings in small packages, okay? All right, let's see. Give me more on the Four of Swords. And what are you watching? Who are you watching? All right. So there's someone that's on your mind, someone that you have a lot of love for. Um, hmm. Yeah, this is someone that you feel very comfortable and secure with. This also may be a friend or someone that you hold in high regard as a friend. This person is also you hold them or you see them as the empress. This is somebody that... Um, yeah, this may be a friend, someone that you've known for a long time. You have history with this person. However, there was some type of communication here between you and this person. Possibly did not go so well. So someone may have uh, distanced themselves from you or you from them. Let's see. Oh, that's who you're watching. You're watching the Empress. Oh, 
That's what it is. You're watching the Empress. This is somebody that you have feelings for. Somebody from your past. Somebody that you really want a connection with. Someone that you are very passionate about. Someone that you can see yourself in a relationship with. Something stable. Someone married to. You're keeping an eye on someone. Yes, you are. Okay something happened here then why or is this someone that you're just interested in give me more you got money coming hmm. really in your head about this person. Four of Swords, Four of Swords. Five of Swords in reverse. I mean, Five of Wands in reverse. So, what's up with the competition? There's no competition here. So, why? Why are you in your head? Why are you in your head? Are you not even in the choosing, in the lineup? In the beginning here, see? There's forward movement. Someone wants forward movement with this empress, but there's someone else on the way. Hmm. Four swords again. You are really thinking about this person. Are you thinking about someone here? I think someone is with someone else. Or they've moved forward. And someone is... Why am I showing it over there? Someone is thinking about bringing you in an offer. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm sleepy. Or you're thinking about giving an offer to someone else. I don't know, but someone is heavily thinking about this Empress here. And this Ace of Pentacles wanting something stable. And this is Taurus energy that's coming up. We have Ace of Pentacles over here. Taurus energy. Let's see. Page of Pentacles over here. Taurus energy. Somebody wants a brand new beginning. Somebody wants to start something stable with this pre-empress. The empress over here. Nine of Pentacles. Look, you got a lot of Taurus energy coming up. Give me temperance. Three of Pentacles. This person wants to work with you. Ooh, they want balance. They want collaboration. This person wants to heal a situation. Bring it together. Work together. This person's being patient. Bring me the fool. There's a lot of Pentacles here. A lot of Pentacles. Judgment. This is somebody that you were with in the past. Somehow or another, there was a breakup here. This person wants to reunite. They feel that they have a lot of love for you. They can't get you off of their mind. This person cannot get you off their mind. They want a brand new star with this empress. Want a brand new star with this empress. But they may feel that you are with someone else. Something to someone else. Something happened here. This person wants to rush in with some type of apology. This person may feel that you are their soulmate. They want something stable with you, something grounded. This person wants to reunite with you. Reconciliation. I'm telling you, this is somebody from your past. This person is possibly, it is no possibly, this person is keeping an eye on you. Not being funny, they might have other people around you watching you too. Somehow or another, something happened here, some harsh communication. Someone got pissed off and cut this person off. Or... You cut them off. You cut them off. They cut you off. Somebody cut somebody off. Wasn't happening. Like I told you, there was a tower here. Something happened. It was probably unexpected. Harsh communication came in. Now somebody wants to rush in and, and stake their claim, say their piece, and hopefully it starts a brand new beginning here. Let's see. Why is the Page of Pentacles here? Uh-huh. 
ha, I want a brand new beginning. I want to start over. I see you as a pre empress, something that we can deal with. You have the nine of pentacles. I have a pentacle here that makes a ten of pentacles. We want something stable to build together, but somebody's guarded, protecting their energy from this person, not trying to see it. And someone is not getting over the past, the things that happened between them. So somebody is going over and over and over in their head the things that happened, okay? How this came to an end, whatever happened here, what I said, what this person said, what he said, what she said, what they said, how all this came about, all right? And somebody's holding back. Somebody's holding back and somebody's holding on to this relationship and somebody's holding back from giving to it. Hmm. And the other person is in their head, can't eat, can't sleep, can't do nothing. All they can do is just think, 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 think about all this situation and watch. Watch it unfold. Trying to make a logical decision to come forward. Wow. And bring balance to this. But I do believe karma has been served. This has moved on. This is crazy. Give me the hangman. Yeah, somebody wants for a movement here. Somebody's seeing this from a different perspective. They want to come in, give clarity. There's new starts here. Yes, look, somebody has moved on, started something else. After that communication came in, this is done over, period, with a T at the end. Moving on. Next. Yeah. Moved on to something else. Oh, that's why Five of Wands is in reverse. This person is no competition. You're not even in the ring. Whoever this is, Taurus, you may have moved on to somebody else. This person is no longer in the in the contender's box. This person is sitting on the sidelines in the audience. All they can do is look. Look, think, and regret. Over the things that were said and done, period. You have moved forward to something else, stable, grounded. Hmm. I'm just saying. And all this person can do is just sit back and go down. If I had a known then, what I know now? Seeing things from a different perspective. Okay, so yeah, I see that you're moving forward to something else. And uh looks like it's working pretty abundantly for you. All right, so let's see. Messages. Firm foundation. This is something that you're focused on right now. You are not in 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 the business of having BS come at you right now. Okay. You're taking control over the situation, guarding yourself, guarding your heart, and standing your ground. Okay. Using your third eye, crown chakra, and all the knowledge and wisdom that you have that is telling you that this is the best thing for you and this is what you're doing, protecting your energy from this person. All right, so let's see. This could be you. This could be um, Taurus. This could be you. This could be the cross watcher. I take it how it resonates. You are moving forward, okay? Not being funny, not saying that you don't have love for this person, but you got to do what's best for you. You cut this situation off. You realize there may be a spiritual union between this person, but they may be a what? A karmic, okay? Where you learn karmic lessons from this person and you need to move on from this connection. Cut ties. It's a sacrifice because you love this person, but there's positive movement forward and it's accelerated motion. So not only are you moving forward, Forward, you're moving forward fast, okay? Once you made the decision to move away from this situation, guess what? New doors opened up for you, okay? So divine is telling you, yeah, you're going to have to make that sacrifice, cut this off. It's going to hurt, but you got to free up that space for somebody else. I have something for you, a real divine counterpart, not a karmic partner, okay? All right, so there's that. And uh, where is these other cards at? Okay, they're right here in front of my face. I think I need to go to bed. All right, let's see. All right, thoughts. <laughs> like I said, somebody is think, 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 thinking you're on my mind all of the time. <laughs> Why am I? Oh, my God. I just heard, I don't know if that's Kenny Rogers I heard or or Willie what's his name oh my god what's his name Willie Nelson I think it's Willie Nelson that's what I heard 
You are always on my mind. That, oh my God, but why that song? All right, so you're heavily on this person's mind, obviously. Okay, let's see. All right, so sweetheart, I told you you got money coming, okay? So, yeah, there's some abundance coming for you somewhere, somehow, some way. But you got some money coming for you, so... There's some other things that you need to focus on besides this person here. I say move on with your life and do your damn thing, okay? All right. Courtship. My God, this person is in despair. They cannot get over this situation. What is this? And you have something new in, in your life as well. You've left this person out in the cold, okay? Not only did you leave this person alone and start a new relationship, your money is looking good, too. It's like this person has gotten slapped in the face, punched in the butt. I mean, punched in the gut and kicked in the butt at the same time punched in the butt. That's weird. Okay, so, <laughs> anywho. All right, y'all. Well, I'm going to leave that alone. But, yeah, this person's not feeling too damn good, all right? You're manifesting new beginnings. All right, and and standing up like a boss. All right, so I got to give you that. Applause. Okay, so with that being said, yeah, I'm starting to be silly. It's time for me to go to bed. All right, hold on. Let's get these, and then hopefully some messages from Spirit. My eyes are almost already closed, so hopefully I can see. Let's see. All right, so it says, don't let your past hold you back. Yes. Okay, so sweetheart, look, if you got somebody that's on some ish, move away from it, okay? There's something better for you, obviously. Okay, you have brand new beginnings happening for you, okay? It looks like you're cutting out negativity and, and, and forcing positivity in your life. And you're having nothing less, okay? And with that no-nonsense attitude and that emperor attitude you're bringing in, you're manifesting new beginnings for yourself, okay, and setting boundaries, okay, and someone here is all in their head, I don't know what to say about them, but um, yeah, it's time for me to go, my dogs are barking, anyway, don't let your past hold you back, a time for healing, so yes, you're healing from this situation, oh my god, Chewy, you're healing from this situation, look at the big picture, all right, Know that you needed to set some boundaries with yourself and with this person as well. Focus on self-love, self-care, as I always say, okay? And it's a time to release negativity, okay? So, yeah. And a new romantic cycle begins. So, yeah, you got new love coming in. All right. So, yeah, that's my cue because, you know, Chewy, he's not going to be quiet. So, yeah. Anyway, you guys, thank you for rocking with your girl. I love you guys. Take care. Bye.